our weapons free and clear to engage. Let the mission begin. All right, let it begin. I'm sharing the enemy data S.H.I.E.L.D. has discovered.
maybe I'll run some errands when we get back. Or just hang out. This was actually rather soothing. I always crave sweets after a workout. I wonder why. <laughs> Every mission should go this well. has been temporarily restricted. Message received, ma'am! <laughs> Good boys and girls, don't go out in the rain. <sighs> Just won't let up. It's been this way ever since we entered the Far East. At least we should arrive at the branch soon. That's the stuff that came down before, right? We were rescuing S.H.I.E.L.D. <laughs> I mean, is the red rain really as bad as all that? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it gives people a disease called... Um... It's called... What's it called? The Black Plague. It shares its name with an ancient epidemic, earned by the black scars that form. Any contact with the red rain could cause it. It's a truly terrible disease. There is no known treatment. Even the symptoms cannot be suppressed. Anyone who contracts it is condemned to die. Uh, so I just have to stay dry, right? Getting sick is the worst. You lose all your appetite. Friar has cleared the Red Rain and is continuing south through Far East Territory. Repeat, Friar has cleared the Red Rain and is continuing south through Far East Territory. We're almost there. Rachel, I hope you'll tell me the truth now. Why did you insist on moving the tests all the way out here? It is as I told Director Grimm. I wish to see our God Ark soldiers and my blood unit fight together. Hmm. Very well, Rachel. Listen, you know that the God Ark soldiers will open a whole new era for humanity. They can save us from those monsters. Of course I do, sweet sister. Worry not. I merely aim to ensure that they will serve us very well. Ah, look! The Far East Branch is in view. We've almost arrived. I'm Julius Visconti, Captain of the Blood Special Forces. This is my team. Welcome to the Far East Branch. I am the director here, Paler Sakaki. When I heard that Emil rescued you from certain doom, I just had to meet you face to face. Wait, you mean the Marduk? Our vice captain was the one who fought it off. Ah, so it was you after all. I thought as much. You have my thanks. You're obviously a talented group, and I don't want to waste even a moment of that talent. Let's get you on a mission. The Far East Branch is currently facing several major threats. The most obvious, of course, is the Black Plague caused by exposure to the Red Rains. Another pressing issue is... The Scion. Precisely. A species of origami unlike any we've faced before. Rumor is you've already fought one. The Scions use powerful resonance waves, bias fields, to control nearby herds of Aragami. I'm told Scions also interfere with our God Arcs, as they too are infused with Oracle Cells. Still, against all odds, your unit disrupted its Psionic wave and sent it running. 
truly a thing of wonder. I cannot tell you how reassuring it is to hear the beast can be beaten. So, I beseech your help mitigating these issues. The Red Rain Pandemic and the Scion. What say you? We're glad to help, and we'll do our utmost to see these problems put to rest. Excellent! We'll support you in any way we can. Please make yourself at home here in the branch. That is all for now. Thank you. Dismissed. Director, I asked everyone about their schedule so we could get a proper welcoming party going and... Huh? Is this the blood unit? Thank you, Kota. And yes, this is blood. Great to meet you, Kota Fujiki, captain of the Far East Branch's first unit. Julius Visconti, captain of blood. The pleasure is mine, Captain Fujiki. Awesome. I'm still organizing the welcome bash. Feel free to take a look around till we're good to go. A party? For us? Yes! What kind of fruit are you gonna have, huh? Huh? Will it be delicious? Oh, I bet it will! You can't just blurt that out, Nana. It's rude. You'll have to wait and see. Trust me, the food's amazing here at the Far East. Oh, yes! <laughs> this is gonna rock! Oh, yeah! Intrepid warrior, how do you fare? Oh, our unit's vice captain? I'm Arena, Arena der Vogelweide. We're God Eaters with the branch's first unit, and... How do you find the Far East? Friar is refined, to be sure, but this place has its own charms. The smell of earth and oil isn't unpleasant, it just shows how hard the people work. When I drink my evening tea, all the scents mingle together and I feel the heartbeat of this place. I protect them, and in turn, they protect me. Ah, truly wonderful. Don't you think that's enough, Emil? What? Shouldn't we build a camaraderie with our honored guests? I was in the middle of a sentence. Ah, yes, this little one is Irina. She is the little sister of my sworn sword, Eric der Vogelweide. May his soul rest in peace. Therefore, you may think of her as my little sister L. I rather like that. I am not your little sister. There you guys are. Emil, Harina, we've got a mission. Ooh, they're at it again, aren't they? Sorry about that. This is Arena and Emil of the first unit. Though I bet you already met Emil. He's probably made sure of it. They're pretty talented, I promise. Even though they're, you know, like this most of the time. Should there be something you wish to see improved, Captain? Appreciate your guidance. Hey! I'm nothing like that jerk! Well, okay, sorry, sorry. It'd be great if you took him out on a mission sometime. Of course! Esteemed rivals, let our competition lead both of us to new heights of skill and chivalry! Ugh.
Oh, man. The girls at the Far East Ranch are so hot. This is gonna be awesome. Although, I guess the place does seem a bit run down. Man, I know this is the front lines, but I wasn't expecting this. Maybe I'll just spend my nights on Friar. The Friar's way too hoity-toity. This is more normal. Are you guys serious right now? Normal? Not a chance. If this is normal, what about all the people outside these walls? Huh? All the people we ignore? Just barely scratching out a life? Uh, who are you? Satsuki Takamine, freelance journalist at your service. Hmm. You all look like you've come straight from headquarters, don't you? Yeah. Sorry to break it to you, sister. But historically, I don't do well with journalists. Romeo, this one's all yours. Hey, wait! Where are you going? My apologies for his behavior? Wow, you're really polite. What? Uh, hi. I thought you went on ahead, Satsuki. Oh, pardon me. Didn't I see you all when I visited Friar? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Hi, I can't believe it's you. Really, truly, actually, you. I'm Romeo. You are Yuno Ashihara. I'm not worthy. Whoa, hey, slow it down. If you want to shake her hand, you gotta go through her manager. Me. You know, do you know these people? Not really. I saw them briefly on Friar. I just noticed they were about my age. It's a pleasure to meet you. I am Yuno Ashihara. <laughs> I know! Your songs are so awesome. You're so cool! I can't believe it's you. I'm not worthy. All right, Tiger. That's quite enough of that. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've had people my own age to talk with. I guess lately it has been one stuffy bureaucrat or another begging for autographs. Well, hey, I shouldn't keep Captain Kota waiting forever. So, how about I come back and get you later, you know? <laughs> Look, you seem like the same one of the group. It would be great if you could, you know, hang out with her. She really needs some friends. And keep an eye on that Romeo boy for me. I don't usually let the crazy ones get this close. Thank <laughs> you. 